friends today i am gonna be teaching you if how to make a simple calling card using adobe photoshop hi there everyone well it's me teacher kevin and this time all you need to do then is to sit back relax listen watch and learn the first thing that i want you to take away from today is this you will have good days and you will also have bad days but you will always learn something more something new and you will learn more overall on bad days than good days you will learn more about yourself you will learn more about life love leadership from different principles and you will build your character well my dear students in this world you must learn to accept life so that the world will accept you this process or method will work in any other version of adobe photoshop this time we're going to use adobe photoshop cs6 so without further ado don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and let's start making your calling card all right so as you can see my dear friends we are already in the workspace of adobe photoshop okay and of course the first thing that we will do here is of course to open a new file which will serve as our main paper next thing make sure that you also, you already have a background or you may also customize your own background here okay to make our calling card even more appealing third you must also have that logo to give emphasis with your business name okay so make it a fully uh, named as um, a calling card or a business card so let's open a document Control n or go to file then click in new all right in here let's customize our paper the size is very important so choose measurement as inches my dear friends okay and this time we're just simply going to use our width as 1.5 and uh, um, our height the height of our paper just a tiny one let's just then use one inches okay and the title of course calling card calling uh, card there you go and the resolution 300 rgb and uh, let's hit okay so this is going to be our main paper for our calling card my dear friends all right the next let's insert a background you may also customize the background here using using uh, different shapes all right but this time we're just simply going to add in a photo or image to use as a background so go to file then hit open and I already have here some images okay there you go I have here a sample um, image with a colorful background there you go the next let's select this one using our marquee tool rectangular marquee tool let's just then select it drag left click there you go control C then going back to our main paper let's paste this one control V then control T to resize it there you go just use the drag left then align this one this uh, image then there you go we already have a background for our calling card next of course um let's insert a text which uh in, in which we may put in our uh, um business name okay but uh today i'm just going to, uh, to but today and today we're going to use a layer uh, a shape layer for our text okay i'm going to use this uh, rounded rectangle tool click then drag to create that particular shape all right there you go my dear friends now you may also customize the color of this one using uh, or make just make sure that it is being selected all right your rec rounded rectangle tool tool and you may select different shapes here in field if you want to use red and more okay but this time i'm just simply going to use black for this demonstration okay now you may also customize your shape make sure that it is selected in your layers right click blending options to add an appeal to our um, um, shape all right if you're going to click in bevel contour there you go if you also want to add a stroke or outline in that shape just click in this one then choose the color that you want to use i'm going to use white there you go okay customize the size you may also type in or move this one right 
we're just simply going to use five for this one click ok all right there you go Control t to align the shape okay the next my dear friends let's um type in a text okay using our text tool here just click on this one and then let's type in here uh, our business name all right for example okay um teacher kevin ph it's too big but how are we going to align that one click this one then Control t make sure that it is also selected all right teacher kevin ph is selected let's zoom out this one for a while okay then let's just align this okay there you go all right there you go and next my dear friends of course our logo i also have here a logo again go to file then choose open and then let's choose uh, my logo yo there you go this is that this is not my official logo but i just uh, created it okay make sure that your logo is png so that it's more appealing or it uh, it can uh, free up some space there you go let's zoom this one out again Control t make sure that it is being selected then shift all right and uh, resize this one shift there you go okay and let's just then uh, align it here there you go okay so that this is our simple logo my dear friends all right i will no longer uh, realign it or fix it in a uh, more beautiful uh, setup uh, it's yours to do next time okay the next let's type in here our um services offered right example here i'm going to use 10 as uh, size um computer repair all right let's just then align this one for a while click on here and then Control t there you go resize it all right there you go then if you want to edit this one my dear friends just uh, proceed to layer and select the text then proceed to character and you may in here you may choose different options for the what do you call that one that the font style and the font color as well i'm going to use black in this one okay there you go hit uh, Control t again to resize the services offered okay you may also edit this one by click, double clicking on this one and adding more uh, text here okay then after that one my dear friends uh, let's insert another shape I'm going to use this one as a layer once again okay for the contact numbers Control t then align it there you go the next let's just then copy this text duplicate okay Control t and then in here there you go for increase hit enter there you go and double click on the text for increase all right there you go this one this part uh, you may include your um what do you call that one your services offered and in this part this part um include your cell phone numbers or social media um contacts all right then after that my dear friends that's just simply how it is you may just then add a background the logo and a text okay the more appealing output will be yours to make okay so that's it i hope you've learned something and uh, see you next time